This is our house currently. We're getting ready for baby and we ordered a dresser from Overstock. They shipped it wrong the first time so they sent another one. It was wrong the second time. So now we're trying to get a third one and we don't really know what to do with all of these boxes. We're gonna probably use them to send all this extra wood back. But yeah, our house is kind of a mess right now and this girl who's nesting is stressed. <laughs> I just wanted a dresser. our YouTube channel guys we are stoked that you are here don't forget to like and subscribe as always today we are gonna do an assumptions video Ooh. some of you guys are ruthless <laughs> so we asked you guys on Instagram what assumptions you had about us there's a lot of good ones so we're just gonna go through them today but we're gonna drive up to one of our favorite spots first We'd go outside, but it's just really windy right now. So we're gonna do it in our car and just enjoy these views. Assumption videos are always so funny because like, I don't know, I feel like with social media and just your life being out there 24 seven, it's really easy for people to think that they know you really well. And I'm sure a lot of people know so much about us because we talk about ourselves and, and things that we do and what we like all the time. But it's funny to get some of these assumptions and be like, what the people actually think that about <laughs> us? <laughs> so some of them, some of them I can kind of understand where you get the idea from. Other times I'm just like, whoa, where did that come from? We're gonna start with these assumptions and knock out as many as we can before we get really tired. Sarah kind of has a headache because pregnancy. Why is there always, I feel like there's always something wrong with me. It's pregnancy, man. Sarah's actually been I, I kid you not, sometimes I forget that she's pregnant because she does not act like a pregnant person stereotypically acts. Like, she works really hard. She's always, for the most part, positive, patient, and just uh -huh. like, sometimes has even more energy than she did before she was pregnant. So, I mean, she- I paid him to say that. She paid me to say it, paid and him. I said it really well. Yes. You owe me fifty dollars, Sarah. I know. Sorry, but I'm being serious. She is like not real. I literally feel like I'm the pregnant one. Like, <laughs> <laughs> I'm serious. <laughs> Sarah. Were you? There you go. Come on. Guys. We haven't picked one yet. Manners, Sarah. Just kidding. I were way louder than that oh and gosh. way more than her, so. Okay, this one says Sarah wanted a baby before Derek. Yes. Yes. Very, very true. Mm-hmm. He was on the fence for a while. Yeah, like but. four years. If four that's years. A while. <laughs> but I waited until he said he was ready. I Sarah didn't was it. not selfish and was very, very patient. You will never sleep fighting. That's like... Uh, yes and no. I yeah. Feel like. That's yes and no. But they can't be yes and no. <laughs> we do. There are times when we go to bed mad. Because things, honestly, sometimes we'll get in like an argument. And then we'll kind of go to bed angry. But then wake up and be like, wow, we were so... Yeah, we Dumb. always apologize like, when we wake up. Yeah, like we were just super tired or something and then it just always seems better in the morning. Sometimes though we like have to resolve it before going to bed yeah. because it was just too much. Yeah. Or too stupid. Y'all rarely fight. False. False. You do and I think, I feel like every couple <laughs> you have to have arguments or disagreements. I think we rarely it's... have big fights. Yeah. But lots of little arguments. Mm -hmm. We both like have our little things that kind of make us tick. Yeah. And here's another y'all. 
It says, I bet y'all go to church. Yes. We do. We go to church. Well, not with COVID, but we used to every Sunday. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, we're LDS. So all those assumptions. Church. We are. Church goers. <laughs> Lots of these. That you had sex before marriage. Nope. We didn't. <laughs> nope. Nope, we didn't. Very hard, but no. <laughs> Sarah was more popular than Derek in high school and college. Yeah. Yes, definitely. Derek was Mr. Quarterback. All the girls loved him. False. Not true. Big false. Mm -mm. Yes. Um, don't believe it first. I had a good friend group in high school, but I feel like it wasn't like anything crazy. And then in college, I barely hung out with any friends. <laughs> Well, we got married pretty fast. Yeah, I just had a few. College. But I feel like Sarah played tennis at BYU, which is like a big university and lots of people knew her, so I'd say you win that one. Hey, but. Mm -mm. Uh, I don't know. Popularity is lame. Lame. Doesn't even matter. Nope. Y'all love cheese. Y'all already know this one. First of all, so many y'alls. <laughs> I love it. I like it too. Um, I wish I said y'all more. Yes. Was Derek supportive of your breast augmentation? No, her ex-boyfriend was though. <laughs> we weren't dating. But yeah, I was dating someone else. So. Oh, someone was supportive of it and I support it as well. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> this one is, you have the same love language. It's a good one. No, we don't. We don't. Let's mine. see if we can say each other's love languages. And this is the test. Wait, I forgot good. mine. I know yours though. <laughs> Sarah's love languages are acts of service and physical touch. Yes. What are mine? Yours are words of affirmation and quality time. Oh yeah. Yep. That's good we know each other because I was like, I don't really remember what mine is. You guys have so much fun together and make each other laugh constantly. Derek's not funny. I'm <laughs> just kidding. We yes. do have a lot of fun together. I feel like we sometimes forget to like spend quality time with each other. Like we just are so busy with work and like other things yeah. that sometimes we don't. But then when we actually do like go hang out or go on a date or do something, it like every time is so fun. And Sarah thinks I don't laugh at her. She, I do though, but it takes a lot for me to think it's funny, but sometimes she'll Derek, hit my funny bone okay. just right and I will die. <laughs> Derek's the- uh, I'm hard critique of humor. No, I know you guys know these people. They just like, they do, <sighs> laughs. <laughs>, <laughs> you're super pumped to have a baby and you're not completely ready. True. Yeah, it's way true. I don't know if anyone feels like 100% ready. If you've never- I don't never... even know how to change a diaper. <laughs> gonna figure it out together. I was never like a babysitter and Dirk. I hate poop. <laughs> I don't know. He hates poop. So I... no, we're not completely ready, but we are pumped. Very. And we're just gonna figure it out yeah. as we go. This one says you don't drink alcohol. True, but I think it'd be really fun. True. <laughs> One of the tough things, One decision tough we made things. early it's, on in life. I bet we'd both be very fun if we did drink. You'd be hilarious. You own your house outright and don't have to work much. Yeesh. That is very false. No, so we've- We are renting we've a rented. little one bedroom and we've rented since we've been married yeah. and we work probably 50 hours a week. Yeah. <laughs> Seems at, like. at least. And we both work a lot. We've both gone through different jobs. Mm -hmm. um, now we're working together. Yeah. And then I have school as well. Mm -hmm. But we've never owned a house. It is a goal of ours to, to own one down the road. This one says you're both always happy and you never have a bad day. No. no. We try to be happy as much as possible and be positive people, but we have sad days. Mm -hmm. And Sarah's really good at making my sad days a lot better. And vice versa. Not but as much vice versa. Yes. 
This one says, you both seem so nice, but also seem like the crazy, trendy, popular people I avoid in college. No, I, I mean- I shop at Walmart. <laughs> <laughs> we're not, I don't know. I feel like we don't really fit in that category. Mm -mm. At least when we're, like, when we're with our friends and the people we meet, we love meeting new people and like having fun, but we're also two pretty introverted people. Um, that like to keep to ourselves about a lot of things. So, I don't know, I don't feel like we really fit in that category. This one says you were happy you waited a little bit before having kids. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah. We definitely needed time to like, figure just each other us, out just and... figure out how we work, what each other likes. Derek loves the camera more than Sarah. Yeah. yeah. Yes. No, that's not. No, he does. No, I don't. I don't love the camera more. I think maybe I'm more comfortable mm -hmm. with the camera and I, I don't mind like doing photo shoots and talking into the camera. Um, but she's a lot better at it and I think more fun to watch and look at. They're here for you. I assume that you are no longer active in your faith. Um, that's a weird assumption. Um, Ouch. <laughs> we're very, very active in our faith. With COVID, um, it's made it so we can't actually go and meet in like physical locations on, on Sundays, but we still are very active. Derek sometimes gets annoyed with Sarah's energy. Oh, do I? Do you get annoyed with me? Tell me. Definitely depends on my mood, but no, I don't really get annoyed. I like it when she's a ball of energy. That's true. Like, I feel like he's always wanting me to be more energetic. Yeah, and I'm kind of the one that goes a little too far with the energy. Sometimes Derek just bugs a little bit. <laughs> just a little bit. This one says Derek expresses his emotions more than Sarah. That's actually very true. Derek is very good at telling how he feels and sharing yeah, all of his emotions, and I literally like Sarah's keep a them tough inside. One to crack. High school sweethearts. Nope. High school sweethearts. That would have been cool, though. That would have been. Yeah, I feel like we would have been. Um, Sarah watched my high school games, and I played tennis with his cousin all played, through high school. I feel like we but. should have known each other in high school, mm -hmm. but we didn't. Yeah. Derek can't go five minutes without touching his hair. <laughs> I think I've touched it like a hundred times already in this video. Wait, that's the funniest one. <laughs> Nervous habit. Yes, he really can't, you guys. Uh, the fact I've that you it. picked that up is so funny. That's hilarious. I've done that since I was, <laughs> for as long as I can remember, since I was like five. Yes. You love eating. Who doesn't love eating? Actually, if you don't love eating, you're weird. You know, I actually <laughs> do kidding. get excited for breakfast, lunch, and dinner, so yeah. Sarah loves eating. I love eating. I look forward to meal okay. time. I actually day. love eating, but I don't really eat that much. Yeah. Derek I, is like kind of like bird. Like he doesn't eat like a lot. This one says you're going to be the cool parents. Duh. Duh. We're going to be cool. The coolest. Coolest on the street. <laughs> this one says the pregnancy was accidental. Nope. No. I fully intended. Fully intended. <laughs> this one says you're snotty. Sarah is way snotty. Like, <laughs> annoying. It's like, you're so snotty, it's annoying. This one, like, like, oh, sad. You need to, like, tone it down. No, Sarah's um, not. Sarah's not snotty. Super very, snotty. Very far Get from near snotty. me. Fight you. This one says you're afraid that your hubby will hurt his brain again. Mm. Actually, yes. Yeah. I do worry about that a I lot. I worry about it too. Just, you're kind of prone to some you're getting a lot of in, I He gets a lot of little injuries. injuries, but I do worry about him a lot. Like, if he's surfing, I'm like, oh, I just, or skateboarding, I'm like, protect your head. Yeah. <laughs> it, it does scare me. This one says Derek is a little shy until he warms up to new people. Yes. 
that's pretty accurate. Yeah. I feel like when I make a friend that I am not shy and that I'll talk to them about pretty much anything and be very outgoing and things like that, but yeah, I'm, I'm pretty introverted when it comes to like meeting new people or just putting myself out there, which I'm trying to be better at. This one says you don't like Derek's long hair. There's actually been so many of these. I don't know why. Maybe. Do I give off that You know what it is? It's probably you don't like my long hair. <laughs> no, I actually, okay. I like his hair however he does it. Yeah. Really though, I don't think I've ever told you. Yeah, no, Not she, to have a certain She's hair never style. told me. I buzzed my head and she was like, oh, it looks good. Mm. I've had it really long. Well, the buzz was my least favorite, honestly. <laughs> but if you're... there was one that I actually wasn't like the yeah. biggest fan of, it was the buzz. Yeah. But like any other hairstyle, I love his long hair. I think he could grow it to his butt and I'd love it. This person said, you're really wealthy. Yes, wealthy in love. <laughs> um, no, we're, we're not. Our parents both do good, um, and we're hoping to eventually have good wealth. Um, but right now we rent and make a pretty standard amount of money. So we have high ambitions, but right now no, we're not wealthy when it comes to financiality. Financiality? Is that a word? <laughs> What the freak? <laughs> we're, no, we're not. This is a finance major right here. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, that was weird today. Oh man. It says that I love being pregnant and I want more kids. I don't think she's loved being pregnant. I don't love it, but I don't. Not You're really it. good at being pregnant. Yeah. And she could definitely do it again. I could right? do it like four more times. But. Five more times, baby. Four. Six. Four. Seven. I want four kids. Eight. Sarah could go I'm just for kidding. a lot. <laughs> no, she, how many do you want? Five? I think five's a good number. This one says that you guys are the kindest, fun people ever. You are also high key obsessed with each other. Yeah. Thank you. I don't know that we're the most fun people ever, but we try our best to have fun. I'm um, obsessed with him. Got a lot that said Sarah wears pants. pants. So many pants wearing. Sure, she can have yeah. the pants. Um, Sarah really... is really good at making sure we take care of a lot of the little things in life. But as far as like what we do or like, I feel like we both communicate. Yeah, we both wear pants. On that. They both, yeah, they. We both like to wear our pantalones. Got a, quite a few of these ones too. You're gonna be strict parents. <laughs> Probably not. Probably very. Who's gonna be more strict? Far I from probably, strict. Probably. I feel like I'm maybe gonna be a little more strict than. Well, actually, I don't know. I think we'll do a good job of like teaching our kids yeah. very important stuff, but. As far as being like strict, strict, strict with parents, them, I don't see not. that happening. Yeah. No. This one said that Sarah is a better kisser. No way. Yes. Actually, yeah. <laughs> yeah, she's a better kisser than me. Oh. More experience. No. Yes. Oh, yeah. All right, guys. Those were some really good assumptions. What was that? Hungry. She's hungry. It's time to get some food. But we like doing this. Those assumptions were good. Um, and hopefully you guys feel like you know us a little bit better. And I actually like it's when people funny. think something about me and sometimes I'll like, I'll never like tell the truth about it. And I like people to think something even though it's completely untrue. You guys are awesome. Um, Thanks for watching. Thank you for watching. As always, don't forget to like and subscribe. And we hope that you have an amazing day and we'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.